Jin Woo went off on his own little side quest mission, man, to get some more XP. Y'all could tell shit was already gonna be grim for Jin Woo when he walked through this thing, bro. Look at the way this shit opened. Like, bro, since when did solo leveling have domain expansion? Yo, please tell me y'all felt the same. Please tell me y'all felt the same way when y'all seen that gate open up and he walked through. Like, nothing's good's about to come out of this, bro. And as whooping Express is has his name on it. Jin Woo starts walking through the dungeon and Op pulls up, murked him. Gang of them decided to pull up on him too. Yeah, he off-screened all of them. Watching this shit, I'm just like, okay, that, that nigga cooking. But y'all, I knew there was more to come. I, fe I felt it. Jin Woo went through his inventory and he noticed he had gear and he immediately equipped that. Yo, I just peeped what this nigga Jin Woo just said. He said he never experimented with armor. Nigga, why? Like, who do you think you are, Gojo? Nigga, put that shit on ASAP pronto and immediately. We not doing this, Jen. Like, I fuck with this nigga heavy, but that was stupid. That was that was dumb. Experiment with the armor, bro. That's like somebody giving you a fucking uh, a weapon. You just don't go look at it. Like, what are we what are we doing? Yo, he didn't came encounter with these double doors. And yo, this shit is screaming a boss behind it. Yo, that man Jin won't even ask himself, how bad is this gonna be? Nah, y'all. This nigga asked himself, how bad is it gonna be behind these doors? He knew an ass whooping was coming. Y'all, Jin Woo walked in the room and you could just tell shit was no longer okay for him. Y'all, one of the drippiest characters thus far in the anime up here, man. Night Commander, Hemgris the Blood Red. Y'all, I'm not calling this nigga Igris as long as I live. That is Hemgris to the day I die, bro. That crimson red armor set, nigga. Come on, bro. That shit, man. That shit is hot. That shit is hot. Y'all, Jin Woo knew it was cooked. He knew that. He knew that himself. Hemgris wanted all the smoke, bro. Yo, he blitzed Jim Woo, I knew it was cooked. Igris tried to one-tap that nigga, and that nigga Jim Woo borderline shit on himself. Igris was not done, yo. He said, nigga, get your ass back. Yo, I peeped this shit. This nigga Jim Woo started crying, bro. Like, it's, it's just no way, yo. These are these are tears of fear. Igris then started flexing, bro. He missed on purpose right here, y'all. He just wanted to show Jim Woo what would've happened if I would've hit you. He then said, nigga, pay attention. Like, y'all, this nigga Igris has sunned him, bro. He's putting him across his knee. He then brought this from Ichigo and hit him with a whole getsu. Then we finally decided to go on the offensive. But Jin Woo was so locked in. Look at his face. Like he did not expect Igris to move out the way like that, bro. Yo, I just prayed. I hope the guy what's about to happen next was not gonna be nothing crazy, boy. Cause I, I felt it coming. Igris had a whole view of this nigga's skull. But Jin Woo did a quick spin back and Igris still dodging, bro. He cannot land a hit. Yo, after all that, I started looking like this. I'm like, come on, please fight back, Jin Woo. Land something. But yo, what happened next? Jin Woo made an excellent play. I ain't gonna lie. He fake dropped the knife, grab it. <clears throat> hit that boy Igris. But that shit did no damage. But excellent play, Jin Woo. Igris then tried to come down that nigga's skull cap, but Jin Woo blocked that and that shit sent him back, man. Had him tumbling. Y'all, what happened next, bro, has to be like the most like insane thing ever, bro. I did not expect it. Jin Woo said, fuck all the bullshit. I'm putting a dagger up. Run your pockets, nigga. Yo, Igris looked at him and hit that Majin Vegeta. Yo, I never in my life seen an anime character do that besides Vegeta, bro. So I knew this shit was over with. This nigga Igris dropped the sword, took off the cape, bro, threw off the dagger and said, nigga, Run it. Y'all, I'm not tripping. This nigga Igris was a little too excited. You do, He didn't even smile or anything. You could just tell, bro, because he was so ready to take all that shit off, bro, and really box with this nigga. Y'all, Igris was not playing no more, bro. He had Jim Woo looking like Goku in that one cooler movie. I'm going to plant me a dumbass tree. That man Jim Woo's defense is definitely top notch, man. Igris had him with the order orders. And Jim Woo was like, nigga, if he's stronger than me, shit, I just got to get faster. Which, great idea, nigga. Excellent idea, even. All right, it's time for me to step in, man. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, Jin Woo was not the main character. It was just his turn. It was just his turn, bro. Igris showed us who the main character really is. Jin Woo bounced off the wall and landed a clean blow on Igris, but he blocked it. He then started spamming different attacks to get his combo started, but Igris was not going for it. Hell sweep, mmm, y'all. K that nigga chest in, man. He made this nigga Jin Woo bounce off the ground. Igris was not done. He needed more damage. Nah, 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 yo. Igris had Jin Woo hitting the rig being mad air, bro. This is unacceptable. Ooh, that brother's floating in the air. Jin Woo came through the smoke and seen nothing but red. He then used that spin kick and landed a blow to the back of the head, man. Igris ain't know what to do. Yo, I'm over here like this, bro. I'm just like, finally, man. My nigga got one in. Yo, after that, Igris seen nothing but red. Nah, y'all, imagine a villain and enemy get mad at you because you ruined their perfect victory. Perfect victory, bro. Igris did not want to get touched by this nigga, bro. And y'all, this next combo. Out of here, out of here, out of here, out of here, out of here. Oh! I'm telling y'all right now, if I was Jin Woo and I got hit with something like that, this is my hunter career, y'all. 
We hanging that shit up. Over with. Done. Then pulled a page from Broly Brian, drug that nigga across the road and threw him into that throne, man. Icarus then got his blade, yo. That's about to end this nigga life. But then plot kicked in. That man Jun Woo said, nah, I'm the main character. It was just your turn, man. Got that dagger and shut that nigga straight in the eye. He then stabbed that nigga straight in the jaw, man, and locked in afterwards. <laughs> Not gonna count. Icarus still won in my opinion, bro. Even though he died, Icarus still won. Jinwoo was getting his ass body.